Well, the answer is yes. I did a little experiment to check this out and just see how well it worked. I took some sand and I made it wet. I added 2% moisture to give us a worst case scenario and make it really want to freeze. Then I blended samples of the sand with 2, 4, and 8 gallons per ton of liquid calcium chloride. Stuck those in a freezer and I gradually dropped the temperature of my freezer and periodically checked the samples to see when they would start to freeze. Well, with the calcium chloride samples, I could get all the way down to minus 25 degrees below zero Fahrenheit and no freezing on any of them. And I'm sure I could actually go, go lower than minus 25. So the calcium chloride worked very well at preventing the freezing. Now I thought it would be interesting to you if I also looked at another brine, if we looked at the more commonly used plain sodium chloride brine. So I also did the same experiment using sand treated with 2, 4, and 8 gallons per ton of, of plain 23% sodium chloride brine. It also did a pretty good job of preventing freezing. I was able to get the sand down to about 10 degrees below zero before freezing started. So it was not quite as effective as the calcium chloride, but it still did the job. So if you want to protect your sand from freezing down to a temperature of about 10 below zero, plain sodium chloride brine should work fine. If you want to go colder than 10 below zero, then you want to go to something like a calcium chloride brine or a magnesium chloride brine, something like that.